Chapter 3, Mishnah 3. Continuing from the end of the previous Mishnah, our Mishnah states another rule regarding immersion. A person may not enter the courtyard for the purpose of performing a service, even if he is completely tahor, unless he immerses in a mikvah. The Mishnah now returns to where it left off in the middle of the previous Mishnah, with the Kohen Gadol about to immerse. It gives an overview of the immersions that the Kohen Gadol performed on Yom Kippur. There were five immersions and ten sanctifications, i.e. washings of the hands and feet, that the Kohen Gadol performed on that day, and they were all done in the sanctified area, i.e. the courtyard, on top of the chamber called the House of Parva. Except for this immersion alone, the first one of the day, which was done outside the courtyard.